Hey there, everyone, this is Alcow playing Killer7, and today we're starting a new chapter. Right here in slot A, right here, uh, save time of yesterday, yeah. Completed Angel, and we did fight an angel, so I'm assuming that at the end of this mission, we're gonna fight the sun. Ooh, two faces this time, and two symbols that I cannot read. Uh, they're made of circles, though, and it fading to red. <laughs> Describing, ooh, red moon instead of blue. You know, the different colored moons, huh? Is, is that is that what we're saying? Maybe. Alright. Here we go. Well, we're probably gonna have a cutscene before it starts. Oh. Something. That kind of looks like an explosion. This is a very blurry explosion. July 3rd, 1998. Yeah, the video is the very blurry. All international disputes were resolved. Uh-huh. This day marked the beginning of true peace for the entire world. Is that for so? Of all races. Weirdly electrical the voice. The quickly formed anti-terrorist organizations and set out creating peacekeeping agencies to bring order and security on a global scale. All right. The world unified to do everything in its power to eradicate all the weeds of evil and disorder. The international Something society, tells me it didn't go exactly as planned. Protecting the world from international terrorism. That's pretty bad motto. Terrorism <laughs> and cyber terrorism. But fair enough. Stop all air transportation. Um. Every network station. In a wait, what? Of two years. Wait, what? The likelihood of terrorism. You just shut down airlines. The had changed. How? I cannot even fathom to imagine that. Whoa, the frame right here is a garbage. Of intercontinental um, expressways I cannot fathom like what that would do. Oh, connecting the two major sides of the Building giant world. highways. In the of following course. year of 2003, okay, the construction of a mass-scale distribution system began. All right, and a man-made landmass as large as a city was built over an ocean. The use and research of nuclear energy was banned. That's not and necessarily all a good. And radioactive waste and materials were disposed of at an energy disposal facility right. in the Gibsoft Islands, a remote set of islands off the coast of the Indian Ocean. To be Ocean. clear, Japan now, has a certain view on, on the elimination of the nuclear power that, like, that posed the biggest it's threat to world fair. Peace. It is, you know, the considering what happened there. Of mass destruction. They were launched outside the Oh, that seems like a terrible idea. Intercepted by other that still seems like a terrible idea. People around the world watch these explosions light up the sky. Oh boy. As if okay. Was some kind of dazzling light. I'm shows. sure it was dazzling. These explosions. Wow. <laughs> wow, look at that shot. Became the symbol of world peace. But look, those 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 like residue are landing all around the the, the Eiffel Tower, not the Eiffel Tower. Face. Statue the of Liberty. Ceremony of the UN's World Security Treaty in the year 2003. So this game was 2005. Who called themselves or uh, what is this? Well, well, attacked the ceremony. Yeah, that that, that one real great. The international society by surprise <laughs> and temporarily what? crippled key operations. Are those strangely Nations. draconian measures didn't stop Russia all terrorism? Weird. Other than using terrorism <laughs> to create terror. Oh, that's fear spread okay. throughout the nations like wildfire. There was nothing the police or the military could do to counter the smiling faces. The that is a cool piece of machinery any there. Chance of stopping these smiling faces were the omniscient and almost godlike professional assassins. The key players behind the scenes of the four powers utilized their connections and called upon the group known as. <laughs> Jeez. Subtle. Kill well, yeah, just gonna leave it there. <laughs> their only hope rested with them. Okay. This is bad ideas layered upon bad ideas. Hello, Mr. Smith. Hi. The is drawing near. Have you decided on your vote? If you have it, wow. The Republic Party make the most of your precious vote. Thank you and have a nice day. Time has not changed. <laughs> yeah, what are you right. eating? Shredded weeds? I ain't sure. Alright. Here we are. At home. Do I have a map? I sure don't. It's my home. They have a house. They have, like, a massive, like, vault door. Oh, you might want to look away if you're not into abuse. 
just seeing a lady kind of beat up on an old man. I kind of vaguely remember the nature of these scenes. <laughs> yeah. What? You want to eat? That's, Make it fast, okay? That's what's going on nine. when we're not on mission, I guess. See, so he's there and he's there, so they're coexisting right now. We have the TV, but I have no real reason to go there yet. Like, we haven't done anything. Um, I can't even access my menu, so I can't check up on my blood amounts. That's a lot of blocks. Wait, I can't interact with anything here. I'm supposed to go to the living room? Oh, yeah, no, that sound is coming from the Harmon room. Fantastic. No, I can't interact with anything here. Maybe I am supposed to go into TV. I don't have a ton of options. All right, then. Ah, Garcian. Oh. How long has it been? So, that's how they talk? Because he just... Ah, Garcian. How long has it been? So I can select him. Okay. I can just select Harmon here. And now... Is awake. Now... Okay. Okay. Garcian, relax. Okay. As you wish, Master. There's an important message for you. Ah, yes. I've felt it. An they live a complicated life. Down a country. I will contact you. If there are visitors for me, call. As you wish. Samantha. The lights. As you wish, Master. And then we're back. It's time. See, Can I go now? See, I can't tell yeah. if the weird things are meant Thanks. to be allegorical or if they are literal and time space is just weird. Like, I can't tell uh, as of this point in the game. All right, so now I guess we can leave. Got a level that's gonna happen somewhere, probably. No, I'm still hearing shouts and stuff here. So, but Samantha's gone, so I don't know where that's coming from, but we're going out. <laughs> don't worry about it. Woo. Uh, all right. We are, wow, we are in actual, in a real place. Yeah. We're going all the way to DC, National Defense Sector. Yeah, the DOD. No, okay, that was drawn. I was wondering if they just literally took a picture of the Pentagon. No, that was arted. Wait, uh -oh. look at this. There's stuff going on. What is this? A bug in the system? Why is there no, a sir, it's weird crunchiness right. in this voice? What the hell? Well, it's a like they're talking to a walkie off the map. Even though they're like there. Do you have the it's impact kind of point yet? Yes, sir. It's Japan. Oh. What? Are the fireworks ready? No, forget it. Japan is our ally. No, we're not authorized to make that kind of decision. Forget authorization. We have to do something now or else. We can't just let it happen. Get the president on the line. Who was president back then? 2005. This is an emergency call for the president. Mr. President, this is Spencer speaking, sir. 200 pulsars have been fired towards Japan. Pulsars? We're unable to compute their trajectory since we're avoiding the computation time lag. Interception can only commence two hours before initial impact. Shall we launch the fireworks? Mr. President, your assessment, sir. Huh, okay. I feel like the tone of the nature of what we're dealing with has changed a lot between zero and one, hasn't it? Well, now we're zooming back out. Whoop, back to our Washington pixel. Seattle pixel, suburb pixel, ooh, overpass. We're on the highway. 
Here's a drawing of the highway. <laughs> just hang a walk. Met a client. Met a man. Not just an exchange of paper this time. It's a little bit more complicated. I'm silent in the parts. Missiles have been launched. But like a lot of it is I feel I just want Ready. to absorb the story, right? Japan. What's that? Is that a VHS tape? No, it's a bit thinner. Now you're not holding anything. Oh, okay. Weird. Okay, so it's like Washington. a envelope. Uh, restaurant Fukushima. It's a popular joint. And the target? Uh, the owner of the place, Toru Fukushima. Toru See, Fukushima. he's the middleman between the Japanese UN representatives and our government. A government job? Uh, it's a job from all the parties. Japan has turned against us. So Wait, that's what? Why gonna hit Japan? Well, it's a possibility. It depends on how they move. <laughs> It'll be a blow, all right. What will happen to Japan? It's up to the president. They have 18 hours. All hell's gonna break loose over in Washington. And I sure as hell don't wanna be there. Yeah, no kidding. If for some reason you need help, go see a guy named Kasai. Kasai. He's well informed, especially about the Japanese movement. You got all the details in there, okay? This time, the string puller is Fukushima. Now, the integrity and the true worth of Japan is at stake here. Is it? I feel like there's two very distinct things going on at once here. Like, why am I going after the liaison between Japan and the States? I'm not sure, like, how is Ian Bomb? Maybe it is supposed to be weird and I'm not supposed to directly make the connection right now. All right, back to DC. Yeah, there's restaurant Fukushima. <laughs> Big old gate. Hey, this is a battle at Japanese restaurant. <laughs> Decisive battle. <laughs> okay. Honestly, get rid of the governor. Yeah, Toru Fukushima. I guess as an assassin, you don't question that. You got a name, you got a place, you do it. Yeah, honestly, as soon as I'm gonna able to save, I think I'm just gonna end it. Ooh, this place looks really nice, though. I want the other... yeah. I do have a map here. Yeah, this place looks really nice. Because, like, I don't know, man. I feel like I kind of want that to stand on its own. This place looks really cool. Also, by the time I'm done talking to peeps and everything, it's going to be episode length. <sighs> hey, it's not a tight spot, though. It's just bad. It's just flat out. We've, we've, we've evolved. <laughs> There. Hmm? Mm hmm. Yeah, it does. Oh. So it's bad food? Oh, okay. I feel like you're contradicting yourself here. Everyone's contradicting themselves here. That's just the kind of thing we're into. Gate! Camera! Yeah, we know what that means. Ooh, make me play as a mask, huh? I just have access to Mask Coyote and Kaede at first. Oh! I... Did not expect there to be people. <laughs> Good start. Alright, I gotta explode that rock. Get out of here, rock. Get out of here, rock? No? No get out of here, rock? Oh! Wow! This man's head is stronger than a grenade. That's exciting. These are just guys. Well, maybe they're smilers. You shall must say. Welcome. Or not. How many in your party, sir? Conf I want to talk to the owner. Oh, that's your yeah, voice? Okay. Yeah. It's so calm. I'm here to kill Mr. Fukushima. <laughs> Certainly. We'll be delighted to serve you. All right, then. Whoop, yeah. Well, I gotta blow them all up with a grenade. Yeah! But when you blow them up, you don't get blood, and you need blood to get bloody thing. What? That's a dumb sentence, but you get what I'm saying, though. All right, and I saw... Waiting room. Wait, waiting room? Is there not a Harmon room somewhere? Maybe it's... Over here? On the other side of the gate? Yeah, there's a save 
there. Huh. Yeah, it's not like I have the ability to turn around. Weird. Alright, well, maybe the waiting room will get there. Let's find out. Waiting room. Let us wait. Ah, <laughs> oh, god damn it. Well, that leads to a bird and a coyote, so... There we go. Oh, boy. Did I really mess that up? Jeez, wait, how do you guys die? Like, I am just not killing you guys. It's very strange. Like, why are you not dead? Okay, you died. You did it. Just making me work for it, buddy. Oh. So these are just flashbangs, basically. So don't worry about it. Here's Travis. He's having fun. What are you gonna tell me? Mm-hmm. What is it? Okay. Sure. I do not have room in my brain to keep that kind of detail, like fake political nonsense all straight. I, that's just not gonna happen. Thief? Hmm. Well, okay. I know now that Coyote is thief, so that's exciting. <laughs> but there's also a bird here. Time to bird it up! Whoa, you got a message on your chest. That's unfortunate. This is a warning to me from Mary. Uh-huh. Oh yeah, I remember that. I get from me to you. I as many talents. Mm-hmm. Cramming your head into a rubber glove. My favorite talent. Dan, straight out of Japanime. Oh, that's a term I haven't read in a while. Mm hmm. All right. Yeah, the old blood spurt trick. Okay, so finally, we're. Well, I mean, this is. Okay. Yeah, and you hit by the rock. Uh, I wonder if. So, like, like, Travis and all those, like, they're people that the Smiths have killed, I'm pretty sure. But I wonder if the Smiths themselves are different people that were killed by Harmon. Ah, uh, so, unfortunately, you just kind of regurgitate things that I already knew. Alright, talking about a thief that can do a mighty leap. Well, you give me the chance to switch right here, so... It's our boy Coyote uh, in the flesh. He's kind of leaning awkwardly. I think he's wearing a different uh, shirt than he was last time. Uh huh. Guitar. Do you want me to do something about it? Like, how do I do a mighty leap? God damn it. Where? What? No! I can't. Good times. Where am I? Like, how would I leave? If you need someone, like, I'm using Coyote. Maybe it needs to be some, not the thief. Where? Like, what? Who's laughing? Why are you holding your gun that way? Please die. You don't need your head. Well, you just died. No! Uh, I guess you died? Uh, ooh, I had, like, takedown or whatever, right? So maybe I kept my level ups from the past? It's possible. That would be good. Maybe I just can't do this thing here yet. Because, like, yeah, but then nothing. And on the map, like, it clearly shows... Yodi, so maybe it's just not something I can do now. All right, I mean, <laughs> I don't see what else it could be. Why are you not? 
take a while like a deer. It's very awkward for me. Yeah, there you go, shutting the arm. Yeah, I swear, you're, you're headless now. Hope you don't need it. Bye -bye. Yeah, so I got a bit to just basically shoot down on them like that, and that's been really good. Uh, I want to heal more. Alright. Okay, well, if I can't do anything here then, let's keep on trucking north to the courtyard. What does this look like on the map? Oh, you can scroll. Kinda. A little bit? Okay, I see. Kinda. Ish. So this is gonna be like a long, <laughs> long walk of death. There we go. No, I thought I got you in the head. God. Ah! Alright. I don't think I got any blood from that. That moon is squishy. <laughs> Turn into squishy moons. Yeah, nice. Oh, fucked. I just wanna heal more. Because I keep being bad. Alright, here we go. So stay quiet. Because I gotta listen for laughs. Yeah, there you go. You're there. You're happy. You know it. Please die. It's your neck? Your head? Weird. Okay, stop me right in time. That felt scary. Big old sprinkles everywhere. If you're into candy. Um, I feel like none of these are represented on the map, so I don't... Maybe we go here? So that's like side room where Travis is. He's having fun. Just drinking the rain as it falls from the sky. Talking about the missile day. Then from hitting and killing. Why would he be involved in getting... I don't get it. Like, what does he have to do with the prison's decision to intercept missiles? Like, I... Hmm. Alright. The game is setting up something. I just... I just don't know if I'm following. Welcome to the lobby. The hobby lobby. Here's a new enemy, the bomb head smile. He has a chill over his head. That's fun. Oh, I see. You gotta wait for his thing to open up. Yeah, got it. I figured out the puzzle. He has a shield. Wait for the shield to go. Alright, I can save to the side, so we're gonna do that. And then I'm gonna be good for today. So we got even a little bit of a preview. <laughs> God damn it, where? I can hear you here. Fucked. Yes, you are. Dang it. Dang it. Yeah! Just in time. Oh, man. Okay. Scary. So from what I understand, the lounge is where you want to go. Yeah, we go here, all the way here, and here, Harmon's room, and it has a big S. So that's where we want to go. While I'm here, though, like, I probably should create some serum. I got some blood that I can go ahead and donate. Maybe work on our pal Coyote here, since I don't have access to Dan. Yeah, so he's all like, whoosh, whoosh. Oh, everyone's wearing different clothing. That's okay. cool. Alright, so. So all the levels up have stuck? Okay, well that's good. So, okay, I think that's good, and power's good. I like to say obvious things. Well, I mean, everything's good, right? Deep down? Alright, Samantha, I'm good for today. World 1 is starting, and honestly, I don't know, I'm getting pretty cool vibe. Like, the place is a lot more interesting visually than uh, just welcome to office building. You know, there's a bit more of a, of a something to it, too.